Hey folks, uh, my name is Morgan. And I'm Bert. Uh, you know the problem, uh, you, you come home after a long day, you like to settle in with a nice glass of wine or maybe a glass or two at dinner. So you walk over to your wine rack, you're, you're perusing your collection and, and then you just start staring at it because the next picture in your mind is uh, pouring half of a, a bottle of really nice wine down the drain because that wine's now shot. Uh, if you don't finish that bottle the first night, uh, what happens is, is uh, oxygen uh, will will react with the wine and basically make it undrinkable. Um, we uh, we're wine drinkers and and we've had this problem uh, uh, over the years and we finally came up with a solution. Our solution, uh, funny enough, is to actually hey we said let's leave the cork in the bottle, but that kind of brings up an interesting question: How do you drink a bottle of wine when the cork's still on it? And the solution we came up with is uh, the Pungo. This is our invention, the Pungo, and um, pretty simple. You use the uh, patented two-chamber needle to just go right through the cork. You don't need to remove it. Done. Tilt the wine like you normally would. Pull the trigger. And right now, Argon is going into the bottle, displacing the wine that's in the bottle, and filling your glass. Yeah, you can see the flow is, is very nice. It's very controllable. Uh, and, and also on top of that, the argon is, is entering the bottle at a very low pressure. Uh, we like to keep the pressure just to a, to a few psi. Uh, what this does is, is it's, it's very safe and, and secondly, uh, that cartridge will now last five to six bottles. So it's very economical as well. That works out to be about uh, less than a dollar per bottle and if you extrapolate, uh, less than a quarter per glass. So right now, the, the, the wine that's remaining in this bottle is, is protected by a blanket of argon. It'll be perfectly preserved until you uh, dispense another glass, whether that's tomorrow, uh, next week, or next year. And that's uh, the Pungo in the nutshell. We look forward to your support, and cheers. Cheers. Here, we wanted to give you a closer look of what happens when you use the Pungo. When the trigger is first pulled, the wine starts to flow even before argon is introduced into the bottle. As the trigger is pulled further, you can see the argon being introduced, which increases the flow rate. Here we're varying the rate of gas release to show how controllable it really is. A very important feature that we insisted on when developing the Pungo was to never allow excess gas pressure in the bottle. The reason for this is twofold safety and economy. The key to this is our patented two-way trigger and valve assembly. It ensures that the bottle has opened the atmosphere during the pour, which prevents any significant buildup of pressure. The Pungo will be manufactured entirely in the U.S. Each Pungo housing, which includes the main body and cartridge cover, are machined from solid blocks of 6061 T6 aluminum, which is commonly used in the aviation and aerospace industries. Precision CNC machining from solid materials is the only way we found to achieve the tight tolerances and repeatability required to achieve a lifetime of smooth and reliable operation. The internal parts that come in contact with the wine are composed entirely of FDA and USDA approved 304 stainless steel. This ensures that no taste will be imparted to the wine. What all this means to the end user of a Pungo is this. From design to engineering to actual fabrication, we've done everything in our power to make each piece as perfect as possible. We really feel that upon using one, you'll appreciate the effort that went into each and every Pungo.